This is Pong from the Keysight Technology. I'm the business director for the wireless device and operator business. Here's my partner, it's uh, Noor. Hi, my name is Yan Noor. I'm the wireless industry solution expert in Keysight. Yep. Hello. Yep. We together today to introduce the Keysight to the 11AX test solution. We know that the, for the wireless uh, the, the connectivity testing, the customer started from ABG and AC, now is moved to the 11AX. And that is a new exciting technology, but also bring a lot of new challenge to our customer from the R&D data validation and to the mass production. So we try to show that it's something that we can provide to make the job easier. Okay, so no, may I ask a question? So okay. you already engaged several key players in this industry. Yeah. So mostly, they, what they see the difference between the AX and the AC measurement, what they already be very experienced, and what's something that they expect from Keysight? Okay, I think uh, for the customer uh, expectation, customer expect that our test of performance can, can have the best uh, test of performance on the uh, uh, 11 AX, uh, like the uh, to support the up to MCX11 mm -hmm. and uh, also up to the 8x8 MIMO, 2 MIMO, and also the bandwidth can support the 160 megahertz. Yeah, that's the most challenge. So uh, today I'm going to show two demos. Well, the first demo I want to show you is I want to use this one. I want to use uh, MSG to transmit the, our single user uh, signal, 11x signal. Uh, with uh, 160 megahertz and MC10 and 5 gigahertz band, uh, uh, frequency. And uh, I use this uh, MSG to transmit the signal and the loop back to the EXM. You know, EXM, we can use EXM to demote this, this, this signal and let's check the best performance on that one. So right now I'm going to show you the, this size so memory the demo, okay? So actually the waveform, uh, the uh, one 60 megahertz bandwidth we from 11x already downloaded into the MSG, and I'm going to uh, to transmit the the signal from the MSG right now. So, and I will set the band radio station to 11x and uh, 60 megahertz, and set the frequency to 5 5.8 to 5 uh, gigahertz, and also I set the MSF to 10. I will configure the MSG. Uh, configure to the EXM. Okay. Okay. So you can see this is GUI shows a constellation, and uh, you can see the IQ symbols. So you can see check the test of performance on this the size of measurement. The EVM we can receive almost uh, 50 dB for the EVM. Yeah, that's the for the size of measurement. I'm going to show you another uh, test, uh, uh, a test of, to show you the 4x4 two, uh, four two MIMO right now. So I will use the uh, EXM of 4 TRX module, and each TRX module will use the VXG to play back the signal uh, into the VXC part. So this kind of the loopback test with the 4x4 four four two MIMO. So, so I will configure 4x4 four four MIMO, and then connect to the EXM. Yeah, you can see. You can see the test result. We have already uh, uh, showed the EVM around the minus 45, and uh, yeah, this is kind of a loop test, uh, memo test result, and this is the function. I know I can also show you the, some uh, memory result in detail. Also, this is some in, uh, detailed memory result here. You can see memory power and the EVM, and also even the IQ offset, all there. Yeah, that's our functionality on the uh, size of measurement and uh, 4x4 four four to MIMO. And also in the future, we can support the up to 8x8 MIMO. That's all for the demo. Uh, I'm very excited that we have this 11x feature uh, in both the MSG and the Spectrum Analyzer. And for more e detailed information, please visit our keysight.com website. Yep. Thank you for staying with us, and I would like to have more engagement with you, the customer, that we can work together to make 11AX into the industry and the market very soon and successfully. Thank you.